What would be a quick way to show a curbless shower in Revit? Essentially show sloped pan drain in wood frame, blah, 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 blah. So um, that's a good question. So a sloped, a sloped drain or something in the middle of a floor. Um, I don't know if this is the exact example that you're trying to ask me about, but I'll make a floor real quick. So here's my floor, All right? <clears throat> so now what you can do is, um, I would actually suggest you make a floor within the floor to make your life a lot easier, um, but you can do it within the grand the grandeur floor. Um, so let's do it two ways. So what I'm gonna do first is I'm gonna make an opening here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then I'm gonna create a floor, or not, floor. That's really weird. Don't be stupid. I'm, I'm, uh, <laughs> my, my work plane was set to, I think that roof or something like that. And so whatever. So I'm gonna make a floor within a floor. Okay. And then with this, you can simply modify the sub elements and do something like placing a point in the middle. Let's say it was in the middle. I don't know if it's in the middle, but I'm just saying that. And then you can say minus four inches and then you got yourself a sloped floor. Um, or if you didn't want to do a floor within a floor, you can do modify sub elements and um, it's going to require um, a few sketches. So for example, <clears throat> if I added a split line here and a split line here, because I think split lines have to go all the way through. So that's kind of why I'm doing that. Actually, it'll be cleaner that way. Um, and so then a split line here and then I can put a point in the middle. And then I can grab this and say negative four inches. And there you go there. So different ways to approach the same thing. But um, I would probably um, stray on the side of this one because then you're not messing with the original geometry, um, which can be super, super detrimental to, to your, your stuff. So my, and then what that was is I selected the floor and I went to modify sub elements. If you guys are not familiar with that, floors you can do some really cool, crazy shit with.